Do you want a short reversion of your simultaneous equations? Coming up. Okay guys, so many people ask me um, they want to do more of these um, simultaneous equations. So I decided we should um, do this video. Okay? So um, this is one question I want to give you right now, okay? $30 is shared among a boy and a girl. The girl gets twice as much as the boy. How much does the boy get? Okay? So you see we highlighted the $30 is shared among a boy and a girl. Means that the first step you should do. So you draw a part whole model. You see that? Yeah. Then, next question is by drawing a comparison model. Because you see the girls get, I mean girl get twice as much as boy. So then you know it's a comparison model. So you draw a comparison model. Okay. So just um, imagine that, just imagine that the boy has one unit. Right? And the girl has two because you know, one times two equals to uh, two, right? So this is what you would do, okay? You see that? Yeah, one unit, one unit, one unit, okay? So you you have to substitute the boy and the girl, right? So then you got three units. So you see, boy one unit, and the girl two units. So you can easily do 30 divided by 3 that your answer is 10. So, the boy gets $10. And so, how much does the girl get? We'll get $20. Okay? Okay, now, next question. A notebook costs twice as much as an eraser. It had bought one notebook and two erasers for $16. A, how much did one eraser cost? And B, how much did one notebook cost? Okay? So, first step, draw a comparison model, you see? Notebook and eraser. Okay? So, next step, do the same. You, you see, a notebook costs twice as much as an eraser. Means, it's a times. So, just do the same like the other one. Eraser, one unit. And notebook, two units. Okay? Next step. So, you do this, draw a part whole model like the one shown over here. Okay guys, did you see that? Ethan bought one notebook and two erasers for $15. So, you draw a part whole model. So, there are two erasers because he bought two erasers. So, eraser plus eraser plus notebook will equal to your total of $16. So, what do you do? You do again, one unit, one unit. One unit and one unit. So once you have four units all together, you can easily do 16 divided by 4 that equals to 4. So A equals to, to 4 and B 4 times 2 that your answer is 8 for B. So these are how you do this simultaneous equation. So hope you um, really understand now. Okay. So, hope you like, subscribe, and ring the notifications to be ready for our next video. See you guys.